Hello everybody, welcome to Let's Play Okami HD episode 30. I'm your host, Ultra Director Jester. Hope you're not expecting to see anything fun or gameplay oriented today, because it's just a whole bunch of cutscenes. What a true ruler. She just got hit with the news that her husband has been killed. It's dead forever. And yet, she remains cool, calm, and collected. You gotta admire that. It looks like it has something to say. Uh, ooh. Uh, hmm. Well. Ah. Uh, whoa. Hey, man. Well. Yeah, giving her the fox shows is a great idea. Great idea. I knew that was a terrible idea, giving her the fox rods. I mean, come on. Who best to hold the dark instrument of the Dark Lord but the God of Sunlight? I mean, come on. It just makes total sense, doesn't it? Doesn't it? Seriously? I mean, come on. Alright, we'll just make our way back to Ankoku Temple.
Kind of glad Orca remembered you. That's, that's kind of nice of him. I kind of almost forgot about him, quite frankly. Well, hey, that's cool. He's just he's just doing his job. He's he's a good guy, you know. Yeah. Every time I come here, I swear I always get that clam. There's always something I'm missing, though. Whatever. We'll just quickly, quickly make our way past North Hiroshima Coast, avoiding all these guys. Also to note, you cannot use Mermaid Springs. You can't. It soon tells you that you can't. I don't know why. While we're in this, I guess, tense chase mode or something, the game restricts you. Because now we can't get into Seon City either. So, Ankoku Temple is the place to go for now. Well, it's the only place we can go to. I don't know if we can go into the dojo or not, but I don't want to find out. We haven't really been there a whole lot, but if you remember, Ankoku Temple is just past this way. Kind of close to where you, uh... Where we went to the sunken ship. There we go. Right here. Whoa. Uh... The hell? That's strange. Might as well, uh, huh? What's with that hand movement? Only ghosts do that. What's going on here? Ah! Ah! Forward! 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 We must follow the ghostly, busty ghost, babe. Ghost. Ghost? Yeah, ghost. Well, where are you? Ta She's taking you there, dude. Patience. Where is she? Oh. Uh, oh, great. Maybe a god and all, but I can't go through walls, man. That there's a secret passage and a ugh, spooky ass looking well. Uh, this can't be good. All right, and where did she go? Wait a minute, who's this? I guess we'll ignore it for now, then. <coughs> Sorry, I don't know why I did that just now. Well, three treasure chests here, one of which is kind of important. Northern Land. It's the place we're going to be going for Season 3. And a pearl. And last thing is Bullhorn. I don't believe there's anything else really of interest up here. Let's go to look around now. Alright, let's go. Where does this secret passage take us? Himiko's Palace. Huh. This can only be a good thing. Uh, ooh. That's not good. Oh, 
Great. Alright, let's see how bad the damage is. This isn't gonna be pretty. Nah. It's a good thing I still have my fire tablet equipped. This is the only real time in the entire game we'll really, really need it. Kimiko! Ooh. Oh, that's not good. Oh, great. What happened? No! Aside from the obvious reasons. Now it all makes sense, doesn't it? You had the fox rods. The most powerful instrument you could have against the Dark Lord, and you lost. I tried to do some research on this. I believe this is the Heart Sutra. Some sect of Buddhism. I don't remember which, though. And now I'm going to take you down. Well, kill him, but... Oh, fuck you! Ooh. Get out of here! Ooh. Two alibis, so nobody would suspect her. Oh, 
Oh, that's not a mask, that's your face? Oh. Uh, okay. This enemy is called Evil Rao, and, well, not as difficult as you may think, especially if you use Veil of Mist. So again, I recommend using an Infinity Stone, and then Veil of Mist, and then all of a sudden, she is completely open to all of your attacks. So while I'm fighting her like this, I'd like to make one little observation. Uh, the Evil Dark Lord, ruler, of, ruler master of all evil and darkness and hatred in the world, uh, t to deceive the people, willingly decided to uh, turn into a busty priestess nun chick. Makes sense to me. Makes total sense. Oh yeah. Yeah, can't hit it when she's rolling like that. She also throws an eyes, which is kind of annoying. They hurt a lot, but. Shouldn't be that hard to take her down, really. Keep on the offensive, you know what you've been doing, she'll be okay. Before too long, Evil Rao should go down without a fight. She's not particularly difficult, she's just a little bit uh, annoying to deal with sometimes. Especially when you can't hit her when she's rolling out of the way. But, with enough perseverance, you should take her out with no problem. Ta-da! Alright, let's finish this. Let's go for- oh, oh. Maybe not. Oh, she's got the- that's right. She's got the fox rods, so uh, with that she unleashes her power, which makes him uh, turn into- holy crap and go oh, cheese! Well, that's the opposite of a good thing. I kind of did. I don't believe you. Just remember, dude. You were a busty priestess with double Ds for a good long while. Ha 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 ha! Yeah. Hmm. What now? Shit. Hey, man, I'm not a man. 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 Hey, man, I'm
So she knew everything that was going on. She planned all of this. Gotta give Himiko some credit. She's got backup plans to her backup plans to her backup plans. She is prepared. Ooh. So as the crystal shatters, so too does a life of Himiko. And as she ascends to heaven, she has our back all the way. can't see it. Wait, oh, wait, oh, wait, there it is. It's kind of like there on the upper corner, but I can't really get to it, because if I zoom in, you can't, well, whatever. I know where to go. Point is, we need to get going to Watcher's Cape immediately post-haste. There's an origin mirror if you need to save, but we don't need to right now. Quickly, to North Ryoshima Coast! Let's take a moment to talk about Himiko and Rao, to their memory. Himiko, as I mentioned, was an ancient shaman queen of 3rd century Japan, back when it was still called the Land of Wa. Much of her history, especially her governing power, has been the center of heated scholarly debates for centuries. Himiko could be sort of an ancient portmanteau between Hime, princess, and Miko, priestess, making her a princess priestess. As for Rao, she is based on the Hapyaku Bikuni, a story where a girl became immortal by eating the flesh of a mermaid and became a nun. A clue to her identity is hidden in her name. Her Japanese name is Suzudao, which, when using the correct pronunciation of the Chinese characters that they form, reads as Kyubi, Nine Tales. Nice job locking the place down, guys. Yeah, I mean, it's not like your queen's dead or anything. Idiots. Speaking of which, we won't be needing this anymore. Take out the fire tablet. So now that weird glow's gone, we're back to our normal selves. Because we won't, we, won't we won't be needing to get into some lava pits for... Well, I don't know, if, if ever, really. Sun setting. Ah, we don't have much time. And there it is. Just beyond those clouds, on the island. We get back here the same way we did before with this cat call tower. Can I reach it from here? I can. Oh, it's up. Ah, come on, get up there. We don't have much time. Come on. Passage of time is still going. Here we are. Beyond those that swirling mist of clouds. Oh hey, Otohime's here. What's up, girly?
Her regret reached you? So the water dragon's not dead, if only you ask it really, really, really nicely to not be dead for a bit. That's cool. Yotohime does shit. She gets up out of her throne and does shit. It's like, oh, what's that? You guys want to get to Oni Island? Well, seeing as you guys got the ore for me, how about if I turn into a dragon and do it for you? Oh, what? Now that's an awesome ass queen that can just turn into a dragon at any given moment. That's so cool. She's the best leader ever. Well, that works. I can settle with that. So next time on Let's Play Okami HD, we penetrate Oni Island and bring the Dark Lord to an end once and for all. <laughs>